Hey guys, so if you ever run into this error message on the Fusion page, there's a good chance you've accidentally hit the Z key on your keyboard. So all you need to do is to hit Z again. This will bring back your original composition. Or you can go to the top of the viewer and then in the drop down menu next to Z, select color. This will switch to the color channel, which will then bring back your composition. Or you can simply hit Z on top of your viewer there, and this will switch to the color channel uh, instead of the depth channel. Now, the reason why we're seeing this error message is because our composition right now on the Fusion page is in 2D instead of 3D. So to help us better understand, I put together a very simple 3D composition here. And if we drag merge 3D into the viewer, we can see that we have our little camera there. And then we have text one, which is the closest to the camera. Then we have our background and we have text two, which is um, in between text one and the background. Now to view the depth channel, the first thing we need to do is to click render node and then under output channels, check Z. Now, if we actually hover our cursor over the viewer, we can see that now at the bottom, we have the Z depth information that tells us how far away each pixel is away from the camera. And you know, the closer the object is to the camera, the smaller the value is going to be uh, and vice versa. So now if we hit the Z key, we're not going to get that same error message again. But there's still one additional step we need to take in order to see the depth channel. So we need to right click and then in the menu under options, select normalize color range. So now this is going to bring us the depth channel and it's in grayscale. The way it works is that our text one, it's closest to the camera, so it's white. And our text two, which is kind of in the middle, so it's in gray. And our background there, uh, since it's the furthest away from the camera, it's completely black. So uh, yeah, basically guys, this is why we were getting this error message before in our 2D composition. And I hope this helps and I will see you next time.